Ceasefire is so needed, but it's not sufficient. It is equivalent of removing one's knee from the dying neck of George Floyd. Both sides agreed the fighting needs to stop, at least temporarily. Local 12's David Winter is live with why they think a resolution from Cincinnati City Council is such an important thing to have. David? Yeah, Paula, there is a tremendous amount of passion here today, even though everyone here knows that the leaders for Hamas and for Israel are not going to hear what a city council thousands of miles away in Cincinnati, Ohio, has to say. Nonetheless, though, there was uh, dozens of people who showed up here today and they showed wanted to show their support for one of two resolutions by city council calling for a ceasefire. Now, the first one called for a six-week ceasefire and for Hamas to release its hostages. It called for unrestricted humanitarian aid to get to the people of Gaza and it condemned anti-Semitism and Islamophobia. It expressed sympathy for civilian victims, and it stated that Cincinnati is welcoming to Jews and, and Muslims it, and people of all religions. And rather than think it, thinking about it in terms of influencing decisions, I think it's about recognizing the local pain, most importantly. Well, perhaps the most poignant moment of the day came out of sight of most people. I was standing out in the hallway outside of council chambers, and that's when a Muslim imam came up to a Jewish rabbi and shook hands. We need to focus on what we can share, what we share more than what can divide us. Since we all agree that this is this genocide should stop, and we should start talking. He and I were in agreement that Whatever happens today, whether both resolutions pass, neither of them pass, any combination, what really matters is what we take from today and use to build dialogue in this community. In the end, council passed the six-week ceasefire resolution, but perhaps the real winner here was the fact that there were two people that represented two people who are so bitterly divided. And perhaps there will be some detente here in Cincinnati, Ohio, thousands of miles away from the conflict. At City Hall, this is David Winter. Back to you in the studio. You can always find our local 12 stories right here on YouTube. Don't forget to tap subscribe, and then you can get all the notifications.